Now, as you know, oh. I've been hey. You know I've been looking for a new coach to take over for me this season. This is Ken Carter. He went to Richmond. He was a two-sport All-American. Still holds records for scoring, assists, steals, basketball scholarship for George Mason University. We're lucky to have Coach Carter. Now let's give him the respect he's due. They're all yours, Coach. Thank you, sir. Good afternoon, young men. As Coach White said, I'm your new basketball coach, Ken Carter. I guess I need to speak louder so you can hear me. I'm Ken Carter, your new basketball coach. Oh, we hear you, dog, but we can't see you. The glare from your big black ass head is hella shiny, man. Damn, do you buff it? <laughs> oh, you got jokes to go along with that ugly jump shot of yours, huh? <laughs> First of all, if you need to know my credentials, as Coach White said, they're on the wall, they're behind you. Secondly, if basketball practice starts at three, you are late as of 2.55. You, shooting the ball. What's your name, sir? Jason Lyle, but I ain't no sir. You're not a sir. Well, are you a madam? <laughs> <laughs> you bitch. As of now, you are a sir. So are the rest of you. Sir is a term of respect. And you will have my respect until you abuse it. Mr. Lyle. How many games did you guys win last season? Like four wins, 22 losses. Sir. Sir. I'm going to give you contracts. If you sign and honor your side of them, we are going to be successful. Damn, do I get a signing bonus for signing this contract? Yes, sir. You get to become a winner. Because if there's one thing I know, it is this. The losing stops now. Starting today, you will play like winners, act like winners, and most importantly, you will be winners. If you listen and learn, you will win basketball games. And gentlemen, winning in here is the key to winning out there. This contract states that you will maintain a 2.3 grade point average. You will attend all your classes, and you will sit in the front row of those classes. Yo, this is a country-ass nigga, dog. Church. Excuse me, did you say something, sir? Worm was wondering, are you some country church nigga with your tie on and all that? Right. <laughs> That's what you trying to say, right? And what is your name, sir? I'm Timo Cruz, sir. Well, Mr. Cruz and Mr. Worm, what you should both know is we treat ourselves with respect. We don't use the word nigga. Are you some preacher man or some shit? Because God ain't going to do you no good in this neighborhood. Oh, I live in this neighborhood, sir. Sir, can you believe this uppity Negro, sir? <laughs> <laughs> OK, Mr. Cruz, leave the gym right now. For what? I'll ask you one last time to leave the gym before I help you leave. Before you what? Do you even know who I am? From what I can see, a very confused and scared young man. Scared of who? Scared of you? I'm supposed to be scared of you? Nigga, I ain't scared of nobody. I would lay your ass out. I don't think so. Teachers ain't supposed to touch students. I'm not a teacher. I'm the new basketball coach. This ain't over! in this contract? Come on, man. Where you going? I don't do high school contracts. You tell us when you meet the real ballers. I will do that, sir. There goes our two leading scorers from last season, man. Then I guess we'll have new leading scorers this season, huh? 
Now, I cannot teach you the game of basketball until your conditioning is at a level that allows me to do so. Gentlemen, report to the baseline. To the baseline! I presume you all know what suicides are. So, I saw the St. Francis game the other night. None of you have a problem shooting the ball. You all had a problem getting up and down the court. If you are late, you will run. If you give me attitude, you will do push-ups. So you can push up or shut up. That's up to you. Yo, how many we gonna do? Sir. Yo, sir. How many we gonna do? Let's see how many you can do in one hour and seven minutes. Uh, fellas, don't make me commit homicide. I said suicides. Put your hand on the line. Put your hand on the line. Man. Can't keep this shit up, man. I can barely walk. I know, my legs is hella sore, son. Gatorade or something. Yeah, that was your girl right there, son. Yeah. Hey, what's with you and her homies? You gonna try to holler at them? Man, I'm hollering at both of the friends. Both of them? Yeah, because I need that. You know, I need variety in my life. I can't just have one girl. You know what I'm saying? I need both. <laughs> ladies, 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 ladies. Y'all heard about that two for one special, right? Two of you, one of me. Now that's special. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, special ad. This box, you working at Chinchilla. But look, baby, me and you. And you need to tell him to stop playing it so close. She don't even like him. Why not? Worm's a man. Worm is worm. Anyway, I got something for the baby today. <laughs> I don't even know if it's a baby yet. I mean, it's kind of early. You, you ain't even been to the doctor yet. Hello? I passed the pregnancy test, can you? Three times. These are kind of cute, though. I know, I got good taste, right? Yeah, I <laughs> Precious little shoes. Well, I got a little something, something for you, too. This definitely is a little something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Where'd you get this? Don't sleep on a 99 cent store. <laughs> Kenyon! What? What's up? Give me, give me. Are you crazy? 99, are you crazy? You got that for 99 cents? I've been there. You can get like three brooms and a bucket for 99 cents with some toilet paper. That's like, that's like thread. That's, that's not even half a shoelace. Well, would you like to see me in the shoelace? That's 10 suicides for the whole team. 250 push-ups for you. This ain't the track team, man. Nor is it the debate team, Mr. Lyle. But you're right. And because you're right, that's 20 suicides for the entire team, and you get the privilege of joining Mr. Battle with 250 push-ups of your own. What, are you serious? Yeah. It's bullshit. Ding, 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 ding. Good answer, Mr. Battle. Johnny, tell him what he's won. Because you gave such a good answer and you gave the coach attitude, you win the bonus prize of 500 push-ups. And would you like to go for the grand prize of 1,000? No, sir. Mm -hmm. To the baseline. On my whistle. Let's go. Come on, JB. Come on, baby.